Hi there. I am representing webtrackofficial.org. We provide all sorts of digital marketing solutions like web designing, social media integration, search engine optimization, graphic designing and logo designing. So if you want any services from us, contact us at support at webtrackofficial.org. In this video I am going to show you how to add autocomplete for address fields in WordPress. Autocomplete allows users to quickly select address from suggestions, generated in real time as they type. So I'll show you, how to use Google Places API, to provide autocomplete to address fields in WordPress. So make sure to watch my video till end and subscribe to my channel. Firstly, we need to install a plugin. So go to plugins and click add new. Now search for autocomplete Google address. Install this plugin right here. Now click activate. Here you can see it's installed. From left sidebar, click autocomplete menu item. Now here we need to add Google Place API, and the form ID. So let's begin. To get the API, go over to the Google's developer console. First, we need to create a project, so click new project from top. Now name your project and click create. Here you can see the project is created. Now from top right notification side, click select project to begin working on it. Here you can see, the project is selected. Now from top left menu, find APIs and services, and click library. Here you'll see tons of APIs that can be used for several purposes. Now we need to enable two APIs, in order for address autocomplete to function. Maps JavaScript API, and Places API. So let's first enable Maps JavaScript API. Here click on Enable. Now here it'll ask you to select your country and currency. Once selected, click continue. Final step. Set up your billing profile. The card details are only for verification purposes. Your card won't be charged until you do it manually, so don't worry about nothing. I've already have card added in my profile, but if you want to add new, you can do that as well. Simply click submit, and your billing profile is ready to use, as is the API. Now let's enable the other API as well. Choose your billing account again that we just created and API will be enabled. Now here you can see, the API key has been generated. Simply just copy it and paste it in the Google API field. Now in the form ID, you need to paste in the ID of the field in which you require this address autoplete to show. Let me show you. I want my address feature to work in this zip code field only. So for that, right click and click inspect. Now let's select this field. Here you can see the ID. Just copy and paste it in the ID field. Now just simply save the changes and let's see. Here you can see, it works completely fine. If you want the address to work with multiple fields, just simply copy the ID and paste it in ID field separated by comma. If this video helped you in any way, like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you later, alligator.